Hi, I am Matt, founder of Testfully. It's great to see that you are also interested in automated software testing. I have been a programmer for more than a decade, and throughout my career, I have developed a passion for this topic. While testing and building my software products at the same time, using automated software testing techniques, I noticed that I spent quite a lot of time in this topic. I was wondering if I could find a tool that I could leverage to test my APIs without spending this amount of time on it. Testful is the product that I wish I had while building APIs. It's a tool that allows you to test your APIs from the get-go while you are building it or integrating with APIs all the way to production. You can leverage Testfully to test your API and monitor them. Now you might be wondering that if this is a tool for backend engineers. No. This is a tool that I built for the entire engineering team. Backend engineers can leverage Testfully's feature to test their API while they are building it. Frontend and mobile engineers also can have test cases for their use cases of an API. DevOps engineers can monitor the APIs in production using Testfully. Software testers can have both happy and unhappy user scenarios for APIs. Without further ado, let me give you a quick demo of Testfully, the features we offer and how Testfully can help you to test your API faster and better. So this is Testfully's dashboard and when you create your account, you should be able to see a screen similar to this one. Obviously, this section for you will be empty. Um, as you know, Testfully is built to help you with end-to-end uh, -end API testing. So uh, let's go through some of the test cases that I have defined. For example, this test case is a quite simple one. Uh, it does a uh, health check uh, test for us. So every time that we run this one, it, it basically checks that if the API is available or not. So one of the cool things about Testfully is that you can uh, add uh, test cases with multiple steps. Each step is basically a simple a request response. One of the things that Testfully supports is the concept of configs. So if you have uh, some sort of data that you want to reuse between test cases, you can use it. In this case, I am using the base URL of my API as a config. Uh, you can include them in your uh, basic URL, header, payload, and uh, obviously in validation as well. Speaking of validations, um, this is one of uh, Testfully's uh, core features. Um, so you can do validations on the status, uh, on the response time, on the headers you receive, and the response body. In this case, I'm, for example, saying that um, I expect to receive uh, OK true as a response. So that is one example of a test case. And uh, let's go and have a look at a bit more advanced uh, basically test case. Um, so this is a good one. So we try to test login scenario. So we're going to test the login API. Um, so as you can see, we can send a post request to this URL and expect that to have a success true and the body to have a field called workspace ID and that should be the value. That is how you define your test cases. Another cool feature when it comes to testing is about generating random data. For example, here I am uh, testing a sign up API and every time that you, uh, I want uh, this uh, test to be executed, I want to generate a new set of information. For example, a new request ID or a new uh, email address and a new password. Um, so that is also supported. Uh, so you can leverage that one as well. You can generate uh, fake data on demand and include in your test cases. So uh, when it comes to running your test cases, you have two options. Uh, you can run your test cases in browser, which is really useful when you are building an API or you are integrating with an existing API while you are building your application and you don't want to wait for uh, basically network latency. So that's perfect for uh, API testing uh, when the API is in your local machine. So that's, uh, I will, for example, pick up this uh, test and run it against uh, my laptop and using the browser. You see this is quite instant and uh, is responsive. That is actually the screen that you see as a result of um, text execution. And if you want, you can also leverage our servers. That's useful as well if you want to test your staging production API and uh, you need a reliable environment, you can just leverage our service. So that's the same scenario, same set of features is available, nothing different. So here I will just pick staging and say that, okay, I don't want to use browser. 
and that's waiting for the test to be executed and you can see the result here. When you uh, execute tests using our servers, you can also see the result of it at any time. Uh, as you can see, I have executed a couple of times and uh, that's working. Um, so with, with test cases, one cool thing about Testfully is that you can define multiple environments. As you can see here, I have three environments. You can have multiple environments and run your test cases against any of those environments. And also, as I mentioned earlier, you have config management. So I have a couple of config configuration values here, like a base URL, user email, and user password. And these values, you can tweak them, you can adjust them per environment as well. Um, to environment section also you can see that we have three environments here and each of them and uh, they have their own values. Um, when it comes to basically uh, organizing your test cases we have a super feature called collections uh, which uh, helps you to group uh, relevant test cases together. You can have a test case in multiple collections as well. So for example I have a critical, critical test cases which has three cases. So I can just go ahead and run this one. So when I run a collection, it runs all of the test cases in parallel, so it's going to be really fast. As you can see, I have three test cases and all of them are passed. One cool feature about collections is that automation, what that means is that you can um, basically schedule your uh, collections to be executed uh, in background, for example, in desired intervals. So let's go and have a look at the example of one. This is a collection that I have, and uh, basically I can have an automation here and say I want this to be executed, for example, a staging environment every minute, and um, I also can receive alerts. If, if any test case fail, I can basically receive uh, alerts so I know that something is uh, basically happening with my API. I can look at it. So I can receive emails, uh, sorry, I can receive alerts through email, uh, Slack, and uh, SMS as well. That's all my friend for today. A quick introduction to Testfully. I hope you have a better picture of Testfully and how it can help you to test your APIs. Testfully offers a free plan, which includes all of the features that I have demoed for you today. So please go ahead and create your account and give it a go. See you next time.